Hey, Ocarina of Time. I'm Time. He's Cable. Last time we entered Ganon's big spooky castle and did a couple of these little, like, mini challenge, like, dungeons or whatever they are. Little mini challenge dungeons using your tools that you've gathered up during your quest. Yeah. You have to penetrate that central lung butter <laughs> pillar, kid. All right, this is the Shadow Temple one. Figure it out, kiddo. Hmm. Well, obviously, first, I must eliminate this bubble. Also, there's yeah, one of those guys over there. Yeah, that quote-unquote bubble, also known as a skull on fire. I should also eliminate this shoot, guy. Shoot, kid! Shoot the skull and the... No! <laughs> okay, well... Got him. You could have been cool by shooting the, the fucking floating bubble and also the lug like at the same time. But that's fine. Whatever, they're both dead. Does it penetrate stuff like that? I don't know if you could have tried to be a cool guy, but now we'll never know. <laughs> I guess not. Now we'll never know. I guess we'll never know. I guess we won't know whether or not they programmed that into this ancient <laughs> video game. Oh, okay. Time, do you like living in a world where N64 games are considered ancient? <laughs> do you like living in that world? I get. I mean... I remember being a little baby like... Oh. Never mind whatever I was talking about. He <laughs> 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 jumped over. It... He jumped <laughs> right over the thing, which is not what Time. I intended. <laughs> it's okay, I've got a chance to try it out now. Well, he's covered in fire right now, they'll just deflect your arrow, kiddo. Oh, I got him when he was fiery the first time. Nope, I missed. I could never be, mind. Okay, well, we'll never know. Like, how many licks it takes to get to the center of Tootsie Pop? It's one to who <laughs> and how vigorously you lick it. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, like, if somebody makes out with it every time, it's like you're probably going to get to the end of it faster than somebody just does a quick little, like, flick on the tongue for flavor, you know what I mean? Also, ew, please stop that. <laughs> yeah, stop doing that in public. I'd appreciate that. <laughs> I say to the zero number of people that eat a fucking Tootsie Pop in real life, like, in front of me. I'm pretty sure most people just buy them and then go home and just, like, crunch them, you know what I mean? <laughs> I think that's fair to assume that most people just go home when they buy those and just eat them. Yeah, probably. Does anybody who's over the age of, like, three actually suck on a sucker, you know what I mean? <laughs> Who has the time for that? Who has the time and ability to avoid, like, pet and also their own hair getting on it <laughs> in between licks? It's like, it just makes more sense if I just crunch this. That's hard candy. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's looking at you like, you don't have the fucking balls to do this. <laughs> You're not going to shoot me, dweeb. Heck. I told you. I told you you wouldn't shoot me. I only have five arrows left. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of need those arrows to hit these braziers, kiddo. I, I kind of do need these arrows, but... <laughs> I've got four. I'm sure that's plenty. At least I just chew those Tootsie Pops and Bubble Pops or whatever the hell they're called. I missed. Time! It was a stationary target! How did that miss? <laughs> I'm sorry I'm failing you, Bear. No, it's okay. Bear, just take strength in remembering all of your memories of beating this game. <laughs> On your own. Just remember how good you are at it. Okay, game. Thanks. <laughs> but you blame the game? It told. It had a music chord. It had like to let you know that it was about to drop. No, when I smashed the the pots, the things just flew right off the cliff. Oh, is that what you were going with? Oops. You should have picked them up and smashed them with your feet like a cool guy would. <laughs> Yo, we'll solve this with two arrows, kid. It's fine. If you don't miss, you'll be fine, time. <laughs> You're on a good start. Okay. Um, oh, okay. Woo, okay. Well, I guess your arrows didn't really matter, did it? Well, no, I need to go find some now. <laughs> Here he is with more arrows. <laughs> uh, he figured out the, the eye of the truth. Yeah, I figured, I figured it out. <laughs> We're cutting to let you know that this is him figuring it out. He did it. He found the rusted <laughs> switch over here. It's been like a goddamn three hours. It hasn't been three. It hasn't been three hours. I'm joking. 
But it's been a it's been a minute. It's been an entire decade. Uh, did you know that we've been sitting on this playthrough <laughs> for twenty years? Okay, that opened that. I was a little baby boy when we started this, and now I'm a full grown adult. <laughs> Here we are finishing it. I used pitch shifting and like effects to make my voice sound similar when we uploaded it. That's the truth of the matter. Sorry, kiddos. Can I make this jump? Is the question. You probably can, but how are you going to get back if you don't have an angle to shoot that brazier? That is also true. Um, you might have an angle. I guess we'll find out. Oh, baby. Oh. Just. It probably just stays there regardless if he can hit this yeah, thing anyway, yeah. so. You have the chest now. I have the chest now. And I do have an angle. Cool. Neat. Assuming I can see the thing. You should just use your slingshot, but like whisper an insult into the pellet when you <laughs> shoot it. Sick burn says the brazier lighting on fire. There we go. Good shot time. <laughs> uh, other side. <laughs> Wee. Tarantino says we shouldn't show what's in here, but I'm going to break the rules. It's a golden gauntlet. I can feel even more power coursing through my arms. Congratulations time. They're there. Just immediately just threw the silver ones over the edge, I guess. <laughs> they don't look as good as the silver ones, though. I checked my heckin' uh, portfolio and these ones aren't worth as much. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> This fashion is not as good. Uh, I'm sorry. That's a like like? What the fuck? <laughs> that looks completely different. I would never have called that a like like and it told me that's what they were. <laughs> I'm responding to our friend in uh, Bear in Discord. They gave me an image of the like likes and I guess Tears of the Kingdom, which exists. Bang. Which I didn't know about until now. What did that do? Oh, well, though, okay. I, see. Uh, it's just a, oh, I don't know. I guess it does the same thing. Yeah, I guess it does do the same thing. I did not need to turn around and shoot the one way back there, apparently. <laughs> well, you had no way of knowing that it would do the same thing to him. Okay, here we go. I don't know if you have an angle on that one from the platform you were on. Maybe? I guess where the treasure chest landed is where you're supposed to shoot that to get the time. Yeah, probably. Okay. God damn it, this is a shadow one, isn't it? Yeah, it is, I think. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was doing. Okay, here we go. <laughs> the shadow barrier is dispelled. Please save the princess. <laughs> you nailed it. <laughs> I did it, everyone. I did an accurate Russian. If you go to Russia, that's how they talk. It turns out that's literally how they talk. If anybody's <laughs> Russian who accidentally stumbled upon this video drunk, <laughs> confirm what I just said. Thank you. I mean, of course, they'll con they'll confirm it because it's true. That's why I said thank you. <laughs> Duh. Here we go on the fire one. Bear confirms that they work with several Russians. That's exactly how it sounds. So it's a perfect accent, everybody. You're timed. Get with it, oh, kid. No, it's hot in here. If only I had something that ah. could do something about that. Okay. Wow. Well, <laughs> you're cheating, says the video game, looking at you using one of the items I gave you. Oh. Ganon just like appears like fucking cortex on its screen. Like, <laughs> God damn it, Link. This is stupid. You know how long it took for me to figure this out, put this together for you? Like... 30 minutes on like a weekend. A weekend, Link. I had to sacrifice like. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that he's a pirate. <laughs> oh, that's right. I was out of plundering and I was putting this <laughs> trap together for ye. And you show up with your tunic and you cheat. <laughs> you scallywag. Heckin' Bill's rat. <laughs> to Davy <laughs> Jones Locker, ye belong. <laughs> er, floaty boots. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the floaty boots. Yeah, I suppose that makes. How do I get to that one, though? 
Uh, floaty boots, kid. Look at me all the way over there. If you roll. Mm. You keep underestimating how much distance you get when you roll. Mm. We'll get a run. Oh. I was going to say getting ready to start from the back of that platform, but whatever. Because you remember when you're running, it's like running on butter because your boots are made of butter. So like it goes slap, 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 and it doesn't go fast. It like slows you down as you start up. You don't get to start up unless you start back from the back of the platform to speed up. Oh, but I see it doesn't. Uh... OK, it doesn't trigger this one to fall, apparently. What are you talking about? It just fell. No, the one I'm standing on. Does this one not fall? I thought it was sinking before. Uh, you need a thing to get that one? There's nothing else to get it. He has everything. Yeah. Also, I need to do that first, maybe. Okay, I guess I do it like this, actually. It's okay. I did it. Probably not how it was supposed to be done, but it worked. Give me this. Aha! My muscles are so big. Why can't I just hit Ganon with one of these? Oh, you did the fucking <laughs> with the graph, the granite thing. Good job. I, I, I threw it really hard. It was well. Well, but and then you died. Fine, it should be uh, open still. It's open. See, well, the graphite thing's still, still there. Do you need, need to move that again? Mm, no, it's open. We're okay. It's open season. <laughs> Remember that movie that had a game that I had to play for my little brother? Uh. Do you remember that particular thing that I had to fucking put up with <laughs> as a person? <laughs> No, okay. <laughs> which, which one was that? Open season was the one about how a bunch of animals went in hibernation. Then when they woke up, like there was a hedge and like on the other side, it was from the movie. No, it's not. I'm thinking of something completely fucking else. What the hell? I was going to say, isn't that movie called Over the Hedge? It's called Over the Hedge. What am I thinking of? <laughs> I think I just remember open season from the trailer from a movie called... Whatever, cut to this. Cut all that out. He's doing it. He's destroying this pustule of fire energy. I am killing it right now as we speak. I am killing... I am ending your life force, he says, whispering it into the arrows <laughs> that it delivers that message with the point of a arrowhead. The fire barrier is dispelled. Hurry up, brother. <laughs> he has like he says that, but he has like a boombox playing the Soraya theme. <laughs> Just it's been in the spirit realm this whole time. <laughs> Everyone else, including Soraya, is fucking sick of it. You have no idea. It's been constant for days. <laughs> All they do is sit there in a circle <laughs> and just heck and do whatever. And he just plays it on repeat. <laughs> All day. It's terrible. I'm sorry, everybody. But this is the truth. This is your last one, I think, right? Uh, I think so. Yeah, because I did the one up there already, I think. Oh, baby. You're almost done with your little mini challenges. Watch out, kid. There's a ghost. The invisible man is about to heck and punch you in the mouth and be like, hey, get wrecked. You can't see ah, me, dweeb. It's just a spider. Well, I guess you're cheating. So much for my superpowers, says the invisible man. <laughs> it was only a sculptula. <laughs> and some bats, I guess. A scooter. <laughs> the way you shoot the bass when they're sitting still and they just like hold their wings up and go eh, and they just shrink down it's really funny to me <laughs> like Ugh. oh no eh, you got me I'm assuming all of these chests are decoys and will do something to me if I open them no okay just had a ruby in it I can't believe you found my, like, savings account, says, oh, that's, that is still a part of my savings account, says Ganondorf. <laughs> yeah, I keep all of my ice in that one. <laughs> that's where I was keeping my ice, but go ahead and take it, I guess. I mean, you gotta, you gotta cool your drinks down somehow. 
right? Ah, I remember that guy. <laughs> <Says Gendor. sighs> ah. Well, my backup, I guess I'll just be going with warm beer tonight. <laughs> Arrows. Uh. More ice? Yep. <laughs> All right. Well, and I didn't need that heckin' frozen fish or anything. Whatever. I'll just buy some fresh ones tomorrow. Okay, thing. <laughs> His dinner is ruined. Do you think that Ganondorf would buy, like, locally brewed beer or buy, like, that regular <laughs> garbage that just gets mass-produced across the country? Across the country? Uh, he would make them make him a specific type of beer that he likes, I think. He, he gets PBR, says Bear. <laughs> he, he, like, has his own brewery, like a microbrewery. He's like, you're not allowed to get any bigger than just selling to me. That's how micro you are. <laughs> He says, like, putting his finger and giant nose in their face. You're going to be as micro as possible. <laughs> this is my specific brewery for me and me only. But it tastes like sh it tastes amazing because you're micro, he says. <laughs> if you give this beer to anyone else, I am cutting your head off. Yeah, just look underneath your feet, and he has, like, several sigils where he just bursts flames beneath them. And like, oh my god, it follows me. It's like, yeah, I went ahead and summoned them to your shoes, kiddo. Wherever you go, you're gonna get obliterated if you sell this to anyone except me. That's how micro you are. I'm really good at magic. Like, you wouldn't even believe. I'm, like, unnecessarily good at magic <laughs> at this point. Whoa, camera. It's all I've been doing for, like, uh, <laughs> Three years. It's all I've been doing for the last three years is getting good at magic. Oh, camera. Stop dying, time. I, I can't. I time! Can't, I can't time. see. The wicker balls are gonna merge into one large wicker ball. Oh, no. I'm not gonna do like, they're too large, so like, <laughs> they're just gonna merge together, but they're gonna be too long, so you can like flip flop on top of each other to roll down the thing. <laughs> they just. They're too big and they just get stuck in the in the track and can't move. We can't roll no more. We're too long. Mm. Oh, my God. Oh, hi. Watch out, kid. What a time. Oh, I forgot that you just look forward. <laughs> they go away. <laughs> sneaky, sneaky Ganondorf. Sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> I like how it does do sounds to show that it's really powered up. It's extra strong. The light barrier is dispelled. Hurry. Goodbye. Flashbang. <laughs> 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 Why do the people keep doing that to me? <laughs> well, you did it a lot as a kid, so like revenge nerd. <laughs> I didn't do it to you. <laughs> Says the tower, coughing up their lung butter. <laughs> it fades back in and it's got like a smiley face and like hearts on it. Oh man, it feels a lot better after I coughed up that lung butter <laughs> cancer that I was growing. Thank you, Lunk. Thank you, Lunk. It says reaching out an entire pillar of, like, <laughs> bricks to pat you on the head. Pat, pat. Pat, pat. Then it retracts it. Okay, time. You're in the final stretch. Am I? This man. will lead you up to Ganondorf. So if there's anything you need to do before we do that, now is the time. I don't think so. You're going to go for it? I mean, I heard he does 15 hearts of damage in a single attack, but... <laughs> Well, time to help you without worry about your health. I will say that there is. I remind you that thing that you looked at before you came into the castle. If you think back, do you remember that thing? Oh, yeah, that's right. That thing you couldn't do anything about because you were too weak baby arms? Oh, yeah, that's right. I can just leave and come back now, can't I? Stop it! I mean, the entrance to the central pillar is right in front of the entrance to the dungeon itself, so yes. Are they respawning? You can kind of do whatever the hell you want now. You get that? You get that thing I sent you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, can I use Ferrari's wind now? I can. Aha! Uh -huh. 
Not this time, bad. Yeah, I'm going to teleport you to the water temple. Get fucked! <laughs> oh. Oops. I guess no. I... No, you want to leave and then do it. If you leave the dungeon and then cast it again, you can teleport back here. Also, the teleport point is just right here, yeah. What? Oh my god, you're so hot right now, Link. My arms are so big. <laughs> because you're wearing red is why. <laughs> His arms are pretty big to lift up a whole fucking pillar, whatever the hell that was. That weighs like a million pounds. <laughs> He's really f imagine getting hit with a sword by this guy right now. <laughs> he should just like one shot anything he's fought so far. <laughs> that and the big Goron sword. Yeah, just one shot, but like before the thing even hits him, they just disintegrate. Like this shot, like one punch man, he punches the air in front of them <laughs> and like just, just obliterates the thing he's trying to hit is what should happen. I should swing this once and just cut the entire castle in half. What would Ganondorf do then? He'd be really upset because he spent like a whole weekend building <laughs> that. Hey, fairy friend. <laughs> Hello. There she is. Welcome, Lunk. I'm the great fairy of courage. I'm going to enhance your defensive power. Receive it now. I will now coat each one of your hearts with a nice, delicious <laughs> frosting layer. Oh. Yes, enjoy, she says. I'm just generous like that. But but wait. Ganondorf will want to eat them even more now. Well, the thing is, he gets distracted by the frosting, so he licks it off first before he takes the hearts <laughs> away. That's the canonical explanation from now on. Your defensive power has been enhanced. Damage inflicted by enemies will be reduced by half. Wow, that's an fucking amazing benefit. Thank you, Great Fairy. That's pretty strong. You are my favorite Great Fairy. <laughs> Here is a flat 50% reduction in all damage, <laughs> says this fairy. <laughs> Meanwhile, condensed fire fairy is like, you get to use this twice here, enjoy. <laughs> and who even cares about goddamn Furore's win? We used that one time, and that's now. We've used that once now. Or a uh, third spell, which does something. <laughs> She is the same fairy, you're right. She gave you the most useless <laughs> spell and then the best benefit, Bear. You're correct. <laughs> no, Nehru's, uh, Nehru's, uh, whatever the hell is the shield. Oh, that's right, it's a shield. Which is actually really useful towards the very end. When battle is made you wary, please come back to see me. What he Goodbye. said. And then they got flushed down the drain, never to be seen again. Can I use the shield against Ganon and just like totally cheese his boss fight? You can use the shield whenever the hell you want, kiddo. There's nothing in the game that overwrites what the spells can do. Mm -hmm. Except for the fact that Din's Fire does, does nothing, nothing against anything. most things. <laughs> but if it's Nehru's, I'll just let you know that Nehru's, whatever the hell it's called, protection embrace, whatever the fuck it is. It's not very useful during the fight. It's useful uh, during other situations. Ah, uh, I see. I suppose it'd be good for like trap rooms. If you're like worried about taking damage while trying to do something, it's good for you. Beams. Oh, they crossed the streams. I guess the world's whole screwed now. Well, they blew up Ganon's castle. I didn't even have to really do anything. I just kind of walked past them and they did it on their own. The worst part was that I was in it when that <laughs> happened. That's kind of wrong. So time, listen, do you hear that? If I can avoid the bats for a second. It's going to get louder as you go, so just keep heading on. Uh, okay. Huh. Hello, lizards. 
<laughs> oh no, it's you guys who just have a bigger health bar. No, they're Dynol foes. Use your shield well and fight with Z-targeting techniques. These have been around since the primordial era. Why are they serving Ganondorf, having been the first intelligent species on Zelda World? What's this world called? Does anybody know? Hyrule? What's the world? No, Hyrule is the land, like the kingdom. What is the world that they're on called? Is there a name for the world ever? Is there a name for the world ever, I say, pleadingly, towards our friend Bear in Discord who knows everything about Zelda? You don't think so? Well, I'm going to call it Hot Plate Planet. <laughs> the Hot Plate Planet where things sizzle. Well, the hot does live on it, so... That's why it's called the Hot Plate, kid. <laughs> Brain cell, yeah. <laughs> All three of us run the same wavelength. <laughs> Buh. What? I can't believe that happened twice. It's impossible. Oh, are you guys? I assume they're going to do the revive if I don't kill them fast enough thing this time. Probably. I don't remember, but probably, yeah. No. Beat him, time. Kill him. I am. No, cuz. Ah, you were wrong, by the way. They don't do the. That happened one time, and then they never did it again. <laughs> You're using your overpowered ass big one. I never realized how easy this is when using <laughs> the big one sword. Like I said, I only used it one time. That's for a very specific situation. I always use the master sword every other time. Yeah, it's way better than that dork master sword. <laughs> it's really good in every situation. <laughs> it's broken almost. It turns out Big Goron is really, really good at making swords. Yeah, it turns out this really long side quest pays off, like, in <laughs> dividends. I got the boss key. But I don't see the boss door. <laughs> Isa swallowing the raspberry <laughs> jelly filling. Hmm. Oh, no, no, Link, that's what gives it its power to open the boss door. Well, I guess we're stuck here, but it was delicious, <laughs> says Link. Fair trade, I think. Too bad you didn't get to have any, Navi. It would have been better if there was toast as Link getting <laughs> somber. Uh, oh, two of them. Oh, man, fight the black and white knuckles. I forgot to teleport back into the temple. <laughs> you got here anyway. Yeah. <laughs> you can use it to flee if you're feeling cowardly that day. Hey, guys, you just... Save your game, by the way. Like, for realsies. Oh, yeah, I should... You haven't done that in forever. <laughs> in case you want to load this up and play it like later. I don't know. Also in case it just like randomly decides to crash again in the middle of. <laughs> yeah, in case your N64 console decides to crash time. <laughs> in case that happens. Gotcha. Ah, OK, they don't both aggro at the same time. I suppose you aren't a fan of pepper, the healthiest flavor enhancing spice. No, I hate pepper. We offer zero calories and also zero sodium, but I suppose you don't like just pure flavor. That's fine. <laughs> we might be a little bit spicy, but that adds a bit of kick to your meals, I would think. <laughs> Says this pepper shaker knuckle. <laughs> He's just advertising. Oh, okay. <laughs> we need more voices advertising cracked black pepper, everybody. I don't think enough people are having enough pepper in their diet. Black pepper's pretty good, if I'm gonna be honest right now. Just be a voice for it, it's pretty good. Ow, my face. Oh, don't throw me into your salt, friend. Then I won't be able to handle his balance of flavors. <laughs> I have defeated the first of the common spices. I have decided that table pepper is disgusting. I see you don't like salt. That's fine. <laughs> One of the major spices required for a healthy living a balance of your diet. That's fine, whatever. So what if we bloat you a little bit if you have too much? Just simply regulate. You need this, though. It's one of the most vital spices of your diet. Without it, you would die. Unironically, you need sodium. Sodium, a building block of life. I will insert it into your body whether you want it or not. Because I'm trying to save you. <laughs> that was that guy's story. And now the second spice is defeated. I have killed all of them. The only two spices. 
I can't wait for you to fight cinnamon fucking coriander or whatever in the next room. So. I can't wait for the final room before Ganondorf is like fucking saffron. It's like, well, I'm the most expensive one. <laughs> well, we're going to have to continue on and finish this little gauntlet here and beat up Ganondorf next time. Time, you're like on his doorstep. The <laughs> next I? episode will be you fighting Ganondorf. <laughs> Like you're very, very close to the end of the game. The next episode is the end of the game, everybody. Unless time gets distracted and goes off and like looks for heart pieces. I don't know. What if I want to pick some flowers? What, you, what, what about what about that? You can't do that. There's no mechanic for that. There's no mechanic for that time. Well, there should be. Well, you can go ahead and email fucking uh, <laughs> Miyamoto and let him know, I guess. Just send him an email with no subject that just says, I should have been able to pick flowers, period. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> what if I want to go fishing again? <laughs> Why would you do that to me in particular? Why? <laughs> Next time on Zelda. <laughs> Next time. <laughs>